All right, pretty cool right there. Let's talk about your forecast as we're heading into the weekend. A lot of things going on, including up in the Clarion area. They have their autumn leaf festival that will be going on all weekend long. The parade goes on tomorrow. So that'll be a lot of fun. It is overcast. Now we knew that there's clouds will be hanging around. Just said, hey, it's going to be most likely mostly cloudy over the course of the day. 58 year temperature right now. So those clouds keeping our temperature down. We are a little bit behind where we thought we would be, and we might struggle just to hit that 70 degree mark. Still tracking warmer air moving in from the west, so, so I still think we'll hit it. Winds out of the east, six miles an hour. The barometer 30, 16 hundredths of an inch. Dew point is at 55 degrees. That's a measure of moisture at the surface once again. So the lower it is, well, the more cool it's going to feel for you, and the smaller chance for any downpours uh, that we'll see. Here's a look at current temperature 61 in Butler, 58 in the Pittsburgh area, 62 in Denora, Latrobe, 63 degrees, Champion, 65. Waynesburg also coming in at 63 degrees. There's that high temperature we we're just talking about. Seeing that also right above it, the low rain chance, but we can't completely roll out some rain. 70 year expected high, and at times this afternoon, at some point, we'll see those winds switching. They'll be out of the south at around 2 to 5 miles an hour. Hasn't happened just yet, but it will, and as it does, our temperatures will start to go up. So we are expecting 70s to so probably be reached between about 4 and 6 o'clock or so. And notice what happens in the overnight hours. We don't dip very much. In fact, at midnight, we're at 62 degrees, 61 at 2, but temperatures start to go up. That's 4 o'clock, 64, and 6 o'clock temperature, 64. We're expecting a high tomorrow of about 80 degrees, but we will have some rain showers and storms around. Small chance for rain today. Get nervous about that because I want to show you radar coming up and you'll see the rain coming in from the west. Saturday chance for rain a little bit higher and then more rain showers, not the stormy conditions on Saturday, but a better chance. I think that you see some rain on Sunday. Monday also there'll be a solid chance for some rain. Here's that rain I was talking about starting to make us a little nervous as it continues to move in. Now data coming in is showing that while we are under fairly stable conditions here. So as the rain tries to move in, it should start to fall apart. Also notice where that rain is basically right above and just north of I-80. That's where most of the rain and storms for the weekend are expected to be not really south of I-80. So that once again means a lot of folks that are watching me right now probably aren't going to have a great chance for some rain. Area low pressure continues to slide tracking just off to the north. That'll keep our rain chances in play. There's that warm front right there that will bring us that warmer air for the weekend as well. So a couple of spotty showers will be possible at least. Now, this model data once again is showing all of that north of I-80 over the course of the day today. By tomorrow, though, a couple of places like Dubois, maybe even Butler sees a little bit of rain as they're waking up. Spotty showers heading into the afternoon as we start to warm up again. But most of the rain and storms again will be north of I-80 overnight little line of showers and storms. We've been tracking it all, all week. It's going to impact the area. Could extend all the way down to Pittsburgh, maybe even south of Pittsburgh. And then as we're heading into Sunday, you can see late, right at 4 or 5 o'clock, rain showers develop. That's important, too, because we do have the big game. Steelers taking on the Falcons 1 o'clock in the afternoon on Sunday. It's looking pretty good for the game. I'm going to keep it dry through about 3.30, 4 o'clock. Probably don't want to stick around too long after the game, though. Rain chances will start to shoot up. After that, here's your seven day outlook. We're looking at 70 your high today. We got some work to do to get there. 80 is possible though. Saturday, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. That's kind of one of those stretches that you know you're not going to see much more of that for the rest no. of the year, especially since we're sitting into October right now. We can maybe sit at one or two 80s again. I was going to say you know, it'll pop up toward the end of the right. month. It always does around the November the first or so, but, but four in a row. <laughs> yeah, you know. enjoy it while we can, I there guess. Yeah, All there right. you go. Thank you. All right.